too often the term public is used when in fact the word government should be used. And a good example of this are schools. Uh, the public just kind of refers to everybody. Can just everybody or just anybody walk into a school and start teaching the kids? Well, no. It has to be a government employee that's picked by a government board. The paycheck comes from the government and everything about it is government. So to call a public school a public school isn't intellectually honest. We should be calling that school a government school. Uh, transportation. Uh, you're transporting people, but who is it that's writing the bill? Who's setting the policy? Who's buying the buses? Who's buying the trains? The government is. Government transportation is what we almost always should be saying instead of public transportation. Those are just two examples. Think about all the times that the word public is used. Public health. Let's talk about public health. The public can't be healthy or unhealthy. The public is an abstraction. It's a word we use to describe a bunch of individuals. Now, each individual can be healthy or well to varying degrees, but we can't, we can't lump everybody into one. We, we can't have a public health that is above an individual's health. You can't separate the parts from the whole. In this case, you just, like, scientifically, like, logic, reason, you can't do that. So there's really no such thing as public health. Now, you can say that a lot of people get chicken pox, and if everybody gets chicken pox at the same time, we're going to run out of cow flour oil or whatever that stuff was. You can say that. Uh, you, you can say that, but, but you, can't, you can't say that the public is above or different or separate from individuals. Individuals are the base, they are the core, they're the foundation of everything, and that is what should be, that's what should be examined. And individuals have doctors. But a group of individuals, a group of 2,000 individuals, none of whom consult with an individual, how can that individual be said to be a doctor for everyone? No, there's no such thing as a public health doctor, public health department. No, no. Now, yeah, it's a good idea if individual doctors are saying, hey, I'm noticing everybody's getting chicken pox right now. This is an issue. Call their buddies, call their patients and say, hey, be careful. Don't get chicken pox right now. We're out of that that pink stuff that we put on it, um, that, that's fine. That's great. We don't need a bureaucracy to handle this stuff. Come on. You know this. I know this. Why do we have a bureaucracy to handle this? It's not needed. 